we're here in San Francisco. There's uh, quite a. This has been quite a uh, momentous uh, weekend. Gentlemen. Yes, it has. It's been a momentous weekend. We have here uh, four of us moment. who have uh, been hey guys. engaged in lots of conversations for uh, quite a while. Uh, for the last few months, I've been uh, I've been talking with Tom and uh, and Ken and Perry, who were all kind of part of the. Uh, you know, of my original conversations a year ago today, when I went to London for the uh, for the whole WeTube thing that turned into the E Nation, but it's all been as a desire to I don't know take this whole idea of community and connection take it to another level. We're not talking about uh, being upset with YouTube as if YouTube wasn't this great world-changing kind of a situation. I think of YouTube as a video sharing site. Yep. First one, it started the whole thing. After people started sharing videos, a community developed around it. I don't think YouTube is the greatest place for community, but I think it's the greatest place for sharing videos. And, and that's the thing, is that YouTube was never designed for community. It was designed just for that, for sharing the videos. And you know the community was was accidental. We we uh, we went there. We met each other. We formed these relationships, but they never had the tools to encourage that. We we kind of nailed it together out of what few tools were there. But the, the, they, rather than encourage that, they, right. they and, and the direction that they've gone into being more of a network and being more of a distribution, yet another distribution for, yeah, video for sharing. the existing, yeah. for for Universal, for right. NBC, CBS, NFL, right. and uh, another distribution channel is not needed. What's needed is some a place that's built from the ground up. What we're what we're doing is, is upside down of YouTube. YouTube was video sharing an accidental community. We're talking about deliberate community and connections, and video sharing is just one tool. There are things that can happen happen between people in a place like what we're imagining that can't really happen in a context like YouTube's context. There's too much else that has to go on on YouTube now that prevents people from connecting in ways that we imagine that they can. The community arrived accidentally on the basis of just one or two very Fundamental. Perfunctory tools. Just, just we'll, we'll, the comment. We'll, we'll fling in commenting, yeah. we'll fling in video replies, because because the, these things facilitate mm -hmm. something, but they don't necessarily facilitate community. But what we're talking about is, a, is, is something where the tools are built from the ground up to facilitate the kind of community that we all want we all want to see and that's the important thing about what we've been talking about you know I'm a member of the Community Council which really uh, for me is a very serious responsibility and I've, I've been uh, uh, really honored to be a member of the Community Council and I've seen that the people at YouTube that there are people at YouTube who care deeply about community who care deeply about and we people. met and we met a bunch of them this weekend Absolutely. we had a lot of conversations with the employees of YouTube really passionately making the case as you know, and we did as well about what's happening. But they care a lot. They care a lot. They do and, care. And 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 I don't think it's a matter of whether or not people care. I think it's a matter of context. You know, what you can get done within a context like like the one that YouTube has developed into, and the business model that has grown around that context is one that lends itself to another kind of a place than the kind of place that we're envisioning. YouTube does not believe, their current philosophy is, is that the community aspect is not profitable. And I have vlogged about that. I think community is very valuable and can be profitable and not by by taking advantage of the, the members or treating them like cattle, but by respecting them. Yeah. And I think we're going to prove that. Who understands it better than us? You have to understand what's going on. Not us, you can the four of us. I mean us. Yeah, us. Us. You, you, you. And everybody you. else. Right. You know, us. We are the people who understand what is going on and what it is that we want. And when you hear our ideas, because you will hear our ideas at some point, not in this video Shortly. probably, but some at some point you're going to hear our ideas and you're going to go, oh, yeah, that's what it's about. That's how we do it. It's something that it's pretty awkward to, uh, to, to share videos with your friends and different types of friends in a, in a convenient manner.